Yo, and welcome to episode number... I don't know what episode number this is. It was episode number something of the Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Nuzlocke. If you missed the last episode, it was over on TXM Hyphen Spurs, but I did upload a compilation um, of all the episodes so far onto this channel, which you can go and check out to make sure you're all caught up and all up to date. But anyway, the team is as follows. We have Boss Baby level... Wait, let me go into the actual summary. Boss Baby level 22, Staravia. Me, level 19, Machop. Squirt, level 20, Pernpub. Uh, iPhone 13, level 20, Luxio. Bojack, level 16, Ponita. Uh, Tim, level 19, Kadabra. Yep, that is the team. I'm kind of having to remind myself about this, because it's been a while since I've turned this on. So I need to remind myself of this. But anyway, the plan is to hopefully beat this before... I doubt we'll do it, but I want to try and beat this before Legends Arceus comes out. Um, because I want to actually make sure, you know, that when Legends Arceus comes out, I'm all ready to, to, to play it. But okay, I don't mind if they overrun a little bit and they overlap a little bit. But anyway, the last episode we took on um, Gardenia. Today we're going to be going south to Vales... Not Valestone. What's it called? Hartome. Yeah, Hartome. That's the plan. Okay. Um, so I think we have to go and do this thing up here first, don't we? Because we have we do have cut now. Let's do it. Let's do it. Cheers, Badoof mate. Appreciate you. And um, we might as well use Tim. So we'll be taking on a lot of poison types, I think. So it's probably a good idea to use Tim. But we need to figure out a way to take down the skunk tank, which is obviously poison dark. My guess is me, maybe. That's what at least we will we'll try out. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's absolutely do it. We, we got this. We got this. Okay. Um. Anyway, how are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty good, thank you. Um. I've been obviously going quite ham on the TXM Tom Spurs channel. Trying to do as many uploads as humanly possible. <laughs> One a day. Um, of Inazuma Ram content again, which has been very, very fun getting back into that. Um, the schedule is quite intense in the fact that I, I basically only work on um, Fridays now. So I'd essentially just um, do Fridays. That's how I spend those Fridays using doing YouTube videos, because it's the, Friday, the only day I have free. So I spend that basically plowing through YouTube videos, which is quite fun. Um, and then, like, editing them throughout the week whenever I get a chance. So it's, it's quite entertaining. It's quite entertaining. But okay, cool. Very, very nice. Glamiao. We can take this thing. And um, we will have to swap around on Tim. Because he has... Yeah, we want to try and swap these around. I don't know how we do that, though. We'll figure it out. Okay, and um, we want to use actually Confusion on Cascoon. And then... Low Sweep on Glamiao. Cool. Okay. Nailed. Absolutely nailed. Absolutely nailed. Okay, 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 okay. Scratch, go for it, mate. You try. Tim does not care. Tim is not giving you a second bloody thought. Nice, nice. Okay, cool, cool. I like that. We nailed it. Okay, Tim is getting some levels, which is very, very, very nice to see. And learn Psycho Cut. Excuse me? Hello? I mean, fair enough. I'll happily take Psycho Cut. Okay. Okay. Um, Pokemon, so I want to go to Tim, and I want to swap, yeah, 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 put Psycho Cut up front, absolutely, hell yeah, okay, slip and slide up, hi, okay, I guess we have to take you on, which is fine, that's okay, I don't mind, okay, cool, but wait, we can absolutely nail this, um, I reckon, I'm trying to think in terms of Skunk Tank, what are we going to do to the Skunk Tank? Because the Skunk Tank is quite terrifying. Um, it could kind of demolish us quite quickly. So I think, obviously, the best bet is probably lead with Tim. But then how do we stop it, the Skunk Tank from really demolishing? We have Intimidate, don't we? On Staravia. So probably worth going into Staravia. Um, and then, yeah, going into Staravia, intimidating it. Seeing what it does. Then switching into Machop and going for some low sweeps or some revenges. Maybe revenge is like what we should be using. That would make sense. Um, and hopefully that way we can kind of demolish it that way. Yeah, I think that's probably the way to do it. I think that's probably... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll go with that. Because we can go for revenge, which will obviously do a lot of damage and kind of demolish it real quick. And I'm also thinking in terms of the next gym, which is... Maylene, um, the fighting type. So obviously, the the good thing of that of the bat is that we already have a Kadabra, which hopefully we can keep around. 
um, can do quite a lot of damage to Maylene. But then obviously like Lucario we have to worry about. Which I guess we have Bojack, who if we can keep Bojack around might be able to do something. Um, or again, me again. Um, we can hopefully do some things. So we definitely, definitely have options for everything. Like for instance, we have iPhone 13, if we can keep that around for Crash Awake. So we're definitely not short on options for things to actually like take stuff down. But it's definitely worth keeping, you know, trying to come up with strategies and worth keeping stuff in mind. And keeping in mind, especially who we want to keep alive. That's the main thing. What's up? What's up, mate? How you doing? Your new world order? I do love the bad new... Um, is it... New, I doubt myself now. I'm pretty sure it's new order. I'm pretty sure that's the name of the band. I don't remember. Oh, it's Kadabra versus Kadabra. What's up? Um, We're going to, I guess... We'll definitely beat this Kadabra. It should probably take a while. <laughs> go on, you mate. You go. Oh, why do you have reflect? How the hell do you have reflect? Excuse me? How? How do you have reflect? That's so dumb. I don't have reflect. Now I'm a Kadabra. How do you have Psy Beam? What? What? Mate. I'm the same bloody, like, I'm, I'm, I'm higher level than you. Wait, I should probably take a look at what Sega Cat actually does, because I'm just kind of using it. I don't really know what it actually, like, genuinely does. Um. Psycho cards. It is formed by psychic power. Oh, but it's physical. Okay, so I probably want to be using confusion instead, don't I? Wait, let me just double check. What's my special attack? I thought it was going to be quite high. Yeah, okay, I don't know why I'm using Psycho Cut then. Never mind, okay, I just teleported. Sure. Sure, of course I did. Sure, why not? Just pop out of there, Tim. Go on, mate. Um, and let's throw in... Who are we going to throw in? We'll go for iPhone 13. Let's go for a bite and just knock it out that way. What's up, mate? Go on, iPhone 13. Take it. Kill it. Kill it. Nice. Very nice. Very nice indeed. <laughs> very, very, very nice. Okay, and look at the, look at the cheeky levels. Me especially, that's quite an important level. Because that might be the make or break. Um, we don't, I don't want a scary face. I really don't want a scary face. Get in there, squirt. We haven't really used in a while. That's fine. I'm not too bothered about that. That's absolutely fine. Okay. Um, we're going to... Use a super potion on Tim. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Um, okay, right. Let's go for it. What we're going to do first, though, is go to Tim. And put confusion up front. Okay. Come on, Jupiter. Take me on. Take me on. I'm right here for the taking. Right here for the taking. Okay, I'm actually, I'm quite scared for this, to be honest. I am quite scared. Commander Jupiter, what's up? Zubat? Okay. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go Exactly. Go on, Tim. I know you can do it, mate. She's two mons, so it should just be this and the skunk tank. Okay, Zubat's gone. Right. Right. Okay, 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 okay. Um, we should have this. Skunk tank, we should have this. We should have this. I'm vaguely worried. <laughs> Take a bite of this child. Yeah, I don't really want to, to be honest. Okay, boss baby with intimidate is our first step of our plan. Okay. And then we revenging. Cool. What are you going to do? Poison gas. Good thing we're switching. Good thing we're switching. Okay, right. I can't see what's boss baby have. Yeah, okay. We have wing attack, but I think I'd rather go to me and click revenge. Especially now we're poisoned. Yeah, definitely. And it's intimidated, so it shouldn't be we shouldn't really have a whole lot. Why? Why would you do that? Okay. Right, we're going to go into square and see what else it wants to pull out of its ass. 
Why does it have flamethrower? I thought it would have like bite and like poison jab and stuff like that. Not bloody flamethrower. Okay, I guess we're going for I guess bubble beams is what we're going for. We have snarl as well. Oh, that lowers our special attack. Oh, that's going to be really irritating. Okay. Right, sure. Well, let's see how much a bubble beam does. Um, nothing. Sick. Really, really, really sick. Okay, let's go for some metal claws. Hopefully, we can get an attack increase. No. Okay. Poison gas. It's a special attacker. Of course, it's a bloody special attacker. Of course, it's a bloody special attacker. Okay. Um, right, we're going to stay in for one more turn with squares. That might be quite risky. Mm, I don't know what to do. I feel like the best thing to do... Well, I should probably double check to make sure what gender is. is female, which means that iPhone 13 will be doing less damage to it than normal. Okay, and we're going to go for a metal, no, because if it goes for, it just has a chance of killing us. So we're going into iPhone 13. I knew this thing would be a threat. I knew it would. I bloody knew it would. Flamethrower, I'm quite scared for you. We're just going to go for a snarl. Yep. Okay, how much is that doing? It's doing quite a lot of damage. I don't think a flamethrower should kill us, is my expert opinion. How much is a spark doing, though? It is a healing item. It has, of course, it has a berry. Of course, it has a bloody berry. Of course, it has a bloody berry. Of course, it does. Okay, we need to hope this doesn't kill. It doesn't. Okay, cool. Um, right. I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. I'm going to go into into you. Why not, Bojack? Go on, Bojack, mate. We're just kind of swapping around, which isn't exactly the smartest thing to do here, but I'm also not really also entirely sure what to do, to be honest. I'm going to go for a Tail Whip. I'm going to start lowering its defense. Um, this is definitely the hardest battle so far. Without a shadow of doubt, this is the hardest battle so far. Okay, yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you just want to keep like not landing your attacks, that's fine by me. Okay. And um, it's now minus two defense. How much is this now doing? Just about half. So we're going to go for one. No, I don't I don't want to risk our only fire type. That we're really only going to get. Okay, let's go into um, boss baby. Let's see how much the snarl is going to do to boss baby. If only, you, if only you were a bloody physical attack, we would be sorted. Okay, we're fine. Okay, 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 okay. We have an opportunity. We have an opportunity. We have an opportunity right here to go for a wing attack. Um, do a lot of damage. Assuming we live this. Yeah, cool. Okay, we should be able to go for one more wing attack and knock it out. Okay. Right, let's go for it. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Sick. Aftermath. If we take poison damage, we shouldn't. We shouldn't. It's, it's over. It's, it's over. We shouldn't take poison damage. Um, no, I don't. I don't want Whirlwind. Yes. Don't let him Whirlwind. Okay. But, oh my god. Bloody hell. My ass is clenched. My ass cheeks are so clenched right now. Oh my god. Bloody hell. Bloody, 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 bloody hell. Okay, but we did manage to beat Jupiter. And um, luckily, literally just... Okay, we need to go to the cycle shop, though. Let's go. Let's go, lads. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We did it. We beat Jupiter. We beat Jupiter. Okay. And um, we're gonna... We're gonna heal up. And then we're gonna go to the cycle shop. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Um, hi. Pokemon Center. Okay, that was terrifying. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, that was terrifying. 
We might also try and go get, um, try and go down the cycling road real quick. Um, and head to, at the very least, start heading towards our home. Because I feel bad the only thing we did was the stupid fight. Where is the cycle shop? Here it is. Cool, 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 cool. Hi! Please, hand over your, your best bicycle. I saved your life, so give me a good bloody bicycle or else that's it. We're fighting. Where are you taking me? Oh, um, yellow. Yellow, I'm a, I'm a yellow boy. See, yeah, I want a yellow bike. It's a shocking yellow. The zap of a Pikachu. Sure, why not? Okay, but let's go. Oh, that is quite cool, to be fair. We do look quite badass. Nice. Okay. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah, I want to speed up. What? Should I worry the man next door? I don't give a shit about the man next door to the Pokemon Center. I don't really give a shit about him, but I'm sure he's, his life plans are quite interesting. Sure. What's up, my guy? Give me some underground thing. Yeah, cool. You can give me the Explorer kit. Trust me, I'm not going to do anything with it, mate. I'm really not going to do a whole lot with it. Um, we'll, we'll figure that out as we go. Nope, never mind. He's taking me to the Grand Underground. <laughs> no, I'm alright, thanks. Ah, fine. Okay. Never mind, it's doing it by itself. I can't even control it. It's doing it by its bloody self. Okay, sure. Oh, what's up, Rock? How you doing? Well, you just have... That's so convenient of you to be right next to where I, I was. I guess while we're here, we might as well um, explore a tad. Because I wanted to at some point, so we might as well right now. What's down here, for instance? Ooh! Okay, what do we want? Question. If I go into a battle against a Gastrodon, am I gonna get am I gonna get ass cheeked? Let's find out. Am I gonna get ass cheeked? Probably. Probably. I'm using a mon that probably won't die to a Gastrodon up front. Oh never mind, we won't get too ass cheeked. Okay, we're gonna go for a bubble beam. To just try and do some damage to it. Because I really kind of want this. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, you have counter. That's kind of devastating. Okay. Nice. We're doing a tad little bit. Oh! That might do a lot. Yeah, it does. Okay, right. Let's, um... Quick. Chuck a Pokeball. Quick. Chuck it. Chuck it. Chuck it. Chuck it. Never mind. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Ah, we have an opportunity. Chuck another Pokeball. Chuck another Pokeball. Ah! Ah! Okay. Go for it. You go for a Water Pulse, my guy. You go for a Water Pulse, Gastro. Okay, I did accidentally run away there, but that's fine. I don't think we would have caught it anyway, but I, I, I at least wanted to test it out and see what kind of levels they would be. But okay. I'm, I'm more than happy with that being our little look at the Grand Underground. Cool. Thank you, old man, for your kind... Oh, I'll take a red... I'll take some red spheres. Sure. Who doesn't love some cheeky spheres? Who doesn't love some cheeky, cheeky, cheeky spheres? But anyway, let's heal up. Very, very nice. Okay. Well, I was going to go down and explore Cycling Road for a bit, but then we got dragged into the Grand Underground. So I guess we'll save that for the next episode as we make our way to Heart Home and actually do what I said I'd do in this episode. But um, I didn't expect the bloody team lactic stuff to take so long. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and all, all that stuff. You guys know. I'll see you guys next one. Bye, sexy.